Don't ever do it. Son of a bitch. It wasn't even, it wasn't even. I'm gonna press new game because it might load me into the other one otherwise. So I'm just gonna start from scratch. Well, all we picked up was some gold. It's not a big deal. I can't, I'm addicted to 144 hertz. Actually, it is. I am gonna have to switch it to display cap. Okay. This is a display capture game. It does not use fucking game cap properly. Give me one sec, chat. One moment. Display cap. There we go. Okay. Turn that off. You guys are gonna see my wacky fucking monitor screen for a second like always while I do this. Stretch and... Oh good, it's one of these ones! Alright, I'll have to window cap it. Oh, you guys are gonna love this. Here we go. There's more steps to make it look right. Get excited! <laughs> one sec, chat. I have to add step number three to the solution. And now, now, it should no longer be dropping frames on motion. Yeah, or maybe not. I don't know. I hate it. You can't tell a difference other than like maybe two pixels at the bottom being cut, but like those aren't actually cut. It's just a little bit more like squeezed, but it does correct some issues sometimes when this shit, when video capture is having problems. Hey man. Hey man. I want to buy a silver crucifix. My pixels. Why did you have to point out those pixels? You'll forget about them in like 10 seconds, don't worry. It's sometimes, sometimes the Unity games do not like, um, do not like video game capture. I don't know why, because it's just Unity. Tab, all right, so these are my skills. I already know darkness sense gives you the ability to sense the presence of powerful evil creatures. Darkness sense has a radius of 500 meters. Okay. I also have Evil Sight. Gives you the ability to see through the eyes of the creature you're looking for. It consumes 20 mana. You would think this is a helpful ability, Chet. You would, you would think this is a good move. You would think this is a powerful ability that will really help you win every fight in the game. Uh, what you're really going to get a load of is looking at mountain sights <laughs> and grass. Uh, it's not going to give you the view that you really need to, like, identify a monster. You're going to see a lot more uh, bushes, like rocks. <laughs> so you guys got to memorize what all the rocks look like for me, because I'm going to need to know exactly what those look like to identify the monster. Hello? All the villagers live in here now, since the beasts came. You're probably looking for Father Ludwig. Unfortunately, he got killed by that horrible beast. That's why I'm looking after the church. I can provide medical help if you need it. No, he's done. What were you saying? Sorry, what were you saying? I couldn't. I was... Get medical help. I'll take some. Yeah, heal me up. Thanks. You're all right, man. I know this book by heart. It's the Bible. Hey! <laughs> hey! Ah, uh, is that even supposed to happen? This is close to a church? Oh, this is how you save. For 50 mana. Pass. <laughs> I need that mana to look through the fucking monster's eyes. Am I gonna... Fuck! Shit! Never mind. I was gonna break into that place and steal the gold that time, but alas, never mind. Oh, we'll do it later. We'll get, we'll get in there later. Come on, let's just keep looking around. 
some sort of fucking owl deer over there. I don't want to consume these. I wish you could pick them up. Fucking sounds. I can definitely get in here with a lockpick later. Yeah, we just need lockpicks, chat. Basically, we're gonna steal everything this fucking village has that ain't nailed down. Alright, that's how this game works. We're gonna steal everything this fucking village has that can be snatched. Alright. Man, this is a dark game, isn't it? I could turn up the brightness. Uh, actually, you guys will have to watch me. Alt tab. Oh, it's in windowed mode now, so you guys don't have to see the background. Okay, cool. I Yeah, the, fil the display capture doesn't have brightness on it, which is why it seems dark right now. Give me a sec. Usually you guys don't complain about that and you actually yell at me when I turn up the brightness. So this is really, this is exciting for me. Really validating. It's like have you guys want me to turn up the brightness. You know? It's really nice. Look at that, before and after. Before, after. Contrast is a nice thing to have on stream. Because for some reason OBS washes out contrast really bad. <laughs> oh! Jesus! Mine. I'm gonna need that to afford my bills. It's too bright, I can't hear you. Well, chat, in reality, if you had looked closely, you would have seen that we didn't actually turn up the brightness at all. We just boosted the contrast, which makes the darks darker and the lights lighter. Honestly, to the point where I should probably turn down the contrast a little bit. I don't know, I usually don't have to do this part live. There we go. Yeah, right about there. Now this is exactly what my monitor's showing. Hello? Hey. Good evening, sir. <laughs> Good evening. As the mayor of Belleville, I can guarantee that if you'll really- Look at his fucking party, mouth! Your doings will be greatly rewarded, and you'll have our eternal gratitude. <laughs> to get to the woods, go across the river bridge. Be careful. People have seen some undead creatures in those woods, so we are dealing with something much more sinister than just a wild beast. Good luck, and God bless you. Tomato sucks. <laughs> Man, I haven't gotten... You know, it's hard, dude. It's hard being me with all these messages coming in on chat all the time, man. It's hard to... It's hard to... It's hard to stay positive, you know what I'm saying, Jack? With all these people coming in. My chat's become so collectively toxic that if someone were to say a mean comment at me, I don't even think I'd be able to identify it as real. Because <laughs> everyone's always just like, Jamal, Fuck you, I hate you. <laughs> it's like, and I'm just like, thanks, ha he. All right, I'm, I have some money. I should probably spend this at the merchant before we go do anything. See, this is a fun hunting game because it's also very fast paced uh, when it comes to the motion and everything. So there's a lot less fucking waiting around, slowly slogging through the world. Like you, you move like a fast boy. Hey man, so I have 61 bucks. I have 15 bullets, not many. I would honestly but just buy more crucifixes. That's like the smart thing to buy early in game. Cause it turns out everything else is bullshit and doesn't matter. Aside from some of these books. Some of these books will eventually be really good, but uh, we will eventually have all of them. From what I remember, we can eventually get them all pretty comfortably. Uh... Oh yeah. We want this. If we save up for Bounty Hunter license, we win the game. That's how you do it. So we're going to basically chat, get a couple silver crucifixes, or maybe even not. We're gonna try to just save up for this Bounty Hunter license, because once we do that, we basically make money forever. The font is so basic. Yeah, well, you, you're, you're in default Twitch chat font for the record. Just so we're on the same page, so don't get too ahead of yourself. You're basically also in the default font. Come on, chat. To the woods. When a powerful monster is within 500 feet, I can sense its presence. People say that I possess this ability because of the blood of an angel runs through my veins. That's bullshit. 
But whatever. The game saves when you enter the fucking woods. Hunt down the beast. Alright. So Chad, we have a pistol. We have a big boy gun. And we have an entire forest where the beast could be. Oh no, Bella. I had hoped you would have managed to run away. Wow, yeah, they got fucking destroyed. Look at its gross-ass eye. Some more bullets. Come on, chat. Switching weapons is faster than reloading. I remember that. There's a woman up on the road. By the save point. Watching it, no doubt. Ma'am! That was 90% sure a zombie, which is why I shot them. Chat. Pretty sure that was a zombie, so we're just gonna shoot them right away. Yeah, that was a zombie. That, that's blood coming out of her face from where I shot them in the head. Making blood come out. Let's reload my gun. Yeah, it takes about this long to reload in this game. Yeah. Alright. Very good. We also have a sword. <laughs> for, for wacky, you know, for, for the wacky parts of the game. Do you hear that? Do you hear that? Does my guy feel short to you guys? Like, extremely short? Like a fucking full-on manlet, like, 5'8 character? Because I feel extremely short. In this right now. Good news is, Chad, right now we're in sort of like a valley situation. Like, we're in a little chasm. $14. We are just gonna save up for that bounty hunter ability, I think. I think that's the smartest thing to do. As long as we stick to rock sides, nothing will be able to sneak up on us. Come along. Uh, uh, yeah, let's go. Let's go, come on. Come on. We gotta explore for treasure anyways, Jet. I should probably check the key bindings, make sure how the game works before I spend like 90% of my mana in like, in, in beast vision by accident. Uh, did I just go in a circle? Yeah, it's a save point from before. Alright, let's not go that way then. You said that last time. What? Wait, what did I say last time? Have I been here before? Have I said these things? I'm in a time loop, chat. I'm in a- I'm in some kind of a time loop. This game does ambience kind of well. This game- this game's perf like presentation chat might seem really crusty right now, but it is genuinely, I will stand by this, the best like spooky monster hunting game on Steam. Without a fucking doubt, because it does the one thing the other ones don't, which is depth of the gameplay. There's like stuff to find. There's things to do other than just hunt the thing. You know? And there's dogs trapped in fucking cave cages. Hey man. Did you steal that treasure? Back there. I don't have lock picks. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. Maybe later. I don't have lockpicks, I can't help him. I can't help him, Chatty. I don't have a lockpick. I'll have to buy them from the guy, but unfortunately I need $300 for my own fucking shit right now. We'll have to help him another time, once I've found some lockpicks. Good news is, there's all sorts of treasure in this game world everywhere. So, um, we should be able to find everything that we need in no time, and we can help him. You'll sense him half a kilometer away. Yeah, the monster doesn't really sneak up on you in this game. Uh, you'll wish he did after a while. <laughs> this game, this game, you actually are the fucking, you are the, you are hunting the thing. It's not them chasing you down most of the time in this one. You are, you are getting them. You're the monster hunter, which is also nice. Something made those birds scatter. Oh God! Ha! 
Yeah! Yeah, that's right! I'm not spending one of my fuck my 14 bullets on you. Do another lap, come on. He'll be back. Yeah, listen to him come. He's coming back. Wait. He might have scampered off all the way. Well, uh. There it is. Dark spirits in the woods. Wandering around. You mustn't look straight at them, or you'll suffer their curse. Hey! Yeah, that's right. I collected your power. It's now in my mana pool. When you kill something, you take its mana. That's how the game works. Oh, I recognize those trees. Yes. Yes. I know those trees. He's this way. There's a monster in this dire direction, chat. I can tell by the trees. This never fucking works, but maybe we'll get lucky and he's actually over here. Nope. <laughs> now we know he was in fact this way. <laughs> The whole time. Yeah, I can smell them a mile away, Chet. Monsters, they got a real pungent fucking smell to them. Did you hear that sound? We're about to get jump scared, by the way, so just get ready. Just so you know, there is a jump scare monster in this game, and he fucking sucks. He can go, like, he can go heck himself. Monster update! He's right next to me. He's actually right next to me. Hey, I need to get out of the- I can't leave the fucking site until the thing's done. He's gonna get me while I'm in his fucking sight. He's right there. He's right there. We gotta get closer to him. Come on. We need to get close so we can get both shots. Easy now. Easy now. Fuck you! Yeah, you don't like that, do you? You don't like that fucking silver! He's running off. They don't like the silver, Chet. Remember, we are- we're the hunters in this one, not him. We are expressly hunting him. There ain't no fucking middle ground here where he gets me. Alright, they hate me. He's gonna be running and fleeing the whole time. But we are not going after him right now because, uh... Because that would be stupid. He doesn't regain health, so we are at... It, we choose when to go after him. Right now, the best thing we can do is explore. Monsters hate him, all caps. We need lockpicks so bad. New fast travel point available in Belleville. We can now fast travel straight here from the starting... Ah! On guard. Okay. Okay. Ow. Ow. I definitely almost got completely killed by one snake. Hey, four lockpicks. And I got a map. Alright, now that we have a map of the area, we can start to figure out exactly what we want to do. This will be our staging ground, chat. Now that the snakes have been forced out. Mm, yes, we can save the dog now. Or we could spend all of our lockpicks trying to unlock this single chest for money. What's up, you creepy fucking goat? You fucking weird thing. You, uh...
That's like a Satan goat. I'm pretty pretty confident. I'm not gonna. I don't want to shoot that thing. I feel like I'd uh, feel like I'd lose to Satan goat. Oh, by the way, the volume is extremely high. When the jump scare, are you fucking following me? You little creepy fucking goat. Hang on. Fuck off! I need to heal anyways. Hey, get out of here. More time we can spend out here without going back, the better it'll be for us. So uh, we ain't we ain't swinging back around to town for a little bit. I reckon. But yeah, the lake is a nice place for hunting. It's really obvious where the monster is when he's near here. It's one of the easiest places to find one. Definitely, definitely ideal. That's what I, that my, when chat for context when we played this last time, it took me like three hours to see that monster one fucking time. Like that's how uh, that's how unlucky I got with his like pathing. I genuinely didn't see him for like three hours. So I consider myself very lucky to have hit him two times right there. In the first like twenty minutes of the game, it was bad. It was real bad. I'm gonna go back and save the dog. Fucking red demon. Those things steal your mana if you look at them. Or it might be that if you are in their line of sight. There's all sorts of weirdness about it. It's one or the other. They're behind a tree right now. I'm just gonna get up here and try to save that dog before it's too late. Also because there's treasure behind him and I could use the money. Is the goat still there? Surely not. Or I'll shoot him this time. Nah, the goat, the goat fucked off. The goat's just eating grass, Jet. Do whatever it is goats do. Come on. Hey, at least we know the monster's nowhere near us. I don't even need my eyesight powers to use to tell that. To tell that. I do wish I could cancel it though. Cause like, that was sketching me out. He was getting real close to us for um, for, during that. And I, I couldn't stop him. I couldn't. I couldn't switch out. I was trapped. Sore spooky. What were you saying about volume? Oh yeah, the game's gonna get super loud because there are jump scare monsters in the game. There's one jump scare, scare monster, and you will fucking destroy everything we know and love. So get ready for that. Uh, it'll happen. How much damage does he do? Yeah, right. You think I've ever been able to tell how much damage the fucking werewolf does when he books it away from me the second he sees me like a little bitch? You're free. You're, wel You're welcome. Okay, well, I didn't expect... Oh. He ate this one. And he also ate this guy. What have I done? What have I done? Whatever, that's a lot of money. That gets us close, chat. We're getting there. We need $300 to get the really good perk. And then we will we will be rolling in cash afterwards. Because we'll make $10 for every monster kill we make in the game. No matter what the monster is. So, we get that? We get that after, like, maybe a couple more lucky lock picks? Cha-ching. I'm going to try to save at this uh, save pool. <laughs> Creepy fucking zombie. Give me a mana. I, I've never seen one run like that. Did you see that? He was he was running right and right for me. He was running right at me. I, I didn't have any choice. Where am, I, where am I on the map? Okay, we're right where we're right where that yellow mark is right now. Okay. So we know the position. I'm gonna save here. And I think we. Should... Uh... I 
think we'll go to the cottage now. Make sure my guns are loaded as we go back to the cottage. There's things to unlock over there, chat. Come along. Oh, that was money all along and I didn't even notice. Well, did it make a sound though? Everyone heard that chat. It made a sound because the tree fell over. And just because you're not there to listen to it doesn't mean a sound isn't being made in the real world. You guys are psychos if you believe otherwise. I don't understand that. I've never understood that. Fucking crazy people. Does it make a sound if I didn't hear it? I don't know, did a burglar actually steal from your fucking house if you weren't there to observe him stealing from your fucking house? What are you talking about, you psycho? You, like, maniac? Ah! What the fuck are you?! The evil is defeated. <laughs> your mana is mine now. There's a jump scare monster over there, I can hear him. Let's just get to the fucking cottage. So jump scare monsters, you can identify them by the sound of whispering. And if they get too close to you, they just like screech and get really loud in your face. It sucks. Thanks for that. You should fight the werewolf with the sword. He's too fast for me, alas. Alas, the odds of that are pretty much zero. He's too quick. He's got those fast feet. On guard. Get back here right now! Ah! Coward! Coward! Come here! That's the dog you saved? No, the dog I saved went back to town because he's smart. He's just gonna keep running for me. I'm not gonna check. Is he here? He's not really near me. He's about as close, he's about as far away as you can get in terms of near me right now. He's on a mountain, probably behind me this way or that way. We're gonna carry on with our business. We're not in the hunting phase yet, in my opinion. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck! All right, we're in the hunting phase now. Werewolf chant. Pretty solid chances on that mountain. I will keep your ears peeled. And your eyes peeled. up here. He might have just activated those birds. No, that's a zombie. There's a healing plant here. If you hit him in the head, there's no crosshairs. If you hit something in the head, it dies instantly in this game. I gotta check the fucking sights. If I don't see him, like, down this hill. I think he's going this way. I got a good feel. Is he on the cliffside still? 
He's on the mountain top. No, he's not. It's by a big fucking rock. Ow! That looks a lot more painful than it actually was for me, and I think the monster's right in front of me, but I'm not gonna be able to aim at him because... Oh no, that's, that's evil. That's evil red thing. Okay, the monster was on the other side of the mountain. Whatever, we get some treasure while we're here. That looked more painful than it was. <laughs> For my character. Whatever. I, we, we aren't really... Oh. Looks like I'm still actually getting pretty near him. Well, we're here for money. I'm cold. We're here to, we're here to take money. From wherever we can take money from. Currently. Blood. Unfortunately, this is definitely locked. Yeah. Which means I am definitely not getting in there. Because all my shit is gone. And he means I had to lockpick are gone. And I can't get in there. Because I fucked up 35% fails over and over again. The heartbeat is fucking annoying. Can you adjust it? No. I can turn the whole game down, but I think it's part of the game. I think you should live with it. Instead of whining. Besides, it's actively a gameplay mechanic used to hunt down the monster, and without it, I fucking can't find the monster? So I'm not entirely sure what you're really asking me to do. So, I don't want to check the, the eyesight thing again, because I feel like he's actually just barely on my fucking, li like, circle of, like, detection. So I'm just gonna follow this line and see if we get lucky. Huh? Oh, is that a, is that a, that's a camp. I might be able to make some money here. Bullets. Four lockpicks and 20 bucks. Lucky me. Yeah, I mean, it's easiest to find him when he's near the fucking lake because it's super obvious. You know? But, like, out here, it's like, what are my fucking landmarks? Rock. He can be near, he can be near a rock or, like, ledge. And he was nowhere near me, apparently. 35 bucks. Lots of money here. How much, how much more do we need? 270. Alright, we open up one more chest. We should be able to get the uh, item we need. I'm gonna break my fucking leg doing this. Yeah, I wasn't anticipating we'd actually find him on that. But I'm also not trying to find him right now. Finding him is going to involve buying, like, silver crucifixes. Sacrifice 50 health? For all my mana? Sure. With healing potions just here for me? You're on. Alright, let's see where the guy is. Wouldn't you know it? It's rocks and trees. See, the only way that we start to figure out where he is is by having landmarks on, like, man-made landmarks on the map. Like, placing our own fucking totems down and shit. So we'll be able to do it eventually. But as it is, like, the, the fucking visual aid is, oh, he's by some trees and a rock. So you're just sort of more of, like, guessing. We're mainly just exploring right now and getting items. Fighting him is a small bonus. Huh. Yeah, that's right, motherfucker, run! You can't reload and run at the same time, so he's definitely getting away. Or we might actually be able to trail him this time. Oh, there's fucking whispers all around. We're gonna get jump scared. If I don't go around this... The bastard's gonna get some distance on us. 
Those guys will jump scare me. Come on. Come on, we can we No, he's he's fucking he's legged it, dude. He legged it so fast when we hit him. He's like out of our fucking range, he legged it so fast, and we can see him running still. That was what that was. If this is a slow zombie, I'm just gonna ignore him. Not very slow. Okay. Come on, chat. We can we can catch this fucking Bigfoot motherfucker. I'm dead. I'm dead, poof. I'm dead. Bye. No crosser, dead. Poof. Lost all my money. It's over. It's pre when we did damage to him now, I'm pretty sure. Optimism was a mistake. Well, I wasn't exactly ready for the instant uh, quadruple hit from sped up zombies. I guess I should spend more of my bullets on them. Or see if there's a way to turn on a crosshair. I don't know if there is. I don't think there's a crosshair option in the game. I'd have to be in the main menu to check. Let me check. Because I feel like I need a crosshair to aim properly. There isn't. Okay. All right. Tomato bad gaming. It's chat. I mean, honestly, the main thing that made this take a while last time was I didn't know what I was doing. I was playing like a fucking clown. I'm not as concerned this time. Have I freed the dog on the save yet? This was post dog save. Okay. I'm not as concerned this time catching him properly because I just I, I already know that fighting him is a fucking side project until I've gotten my money and now I know where to go to get my money really quickly and hell the dog might even come to the exact same spot he did last time might be able to get two free hits on him again right now what was up that with that tree it just fell over like trees do when they fall in the forest and people are around to hear it Overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer at tomato. Yeah, at me more with the darkest dungeon quotes, guys. <laughs> it's very good. It's good. Hey, we might get lucky this time and be able to use these other lockpicks on something without having to go and get more. <laughs> Y'all flummoxed at me and shit, too. I don't know. Whatever you want. Yeah. Flummoxed. Nah, it's not. It's not that bad. Besides, once we get our perks, once we start making money, chat. Here's here's the actual gameplay loop of this game. All right, it doesn't have anything to fucking do with the werewolf. Currently, what we're doing is we're gonna make our money. We're gonna get that bounty hunter perk. We're gonna hunt normal enemies, make a ton of money, buy fast reload perk, and machine gun kill this fucking thing, like in one pull. That's how you actually beat it. Let me in. Okay, thank you. Four more lockpicks for the price of one. Okay. That's not a fast reload. Not even close, chat. In the grand scheme of this game, not even fucking close. Yeah. 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 Ah, oh, that was all of them. They gave me a cannonball, which isn't even... Oh, I still have three more lockpicks. Okay, cool. All right, I'm gonna go to where I think that campfire was from before, over this mountain. We wanna get to the, we wanna get to that tent. Is it gonna be this easy? You think? He's in some fucking... He's in like a... Little ditch. It ain't gonna be that easy. I'm just gonna keep going for my destination. If I remember it. Try to make money. 
That's what matters the most. We want to get to that chest on the top of that hill again. Try to lockpick it. God, I just can't believe how much damage that zombie did. I should have shot him. I'm only- I should only be sword fighting if I'm above 50% health. Second amount, like 50%, they can just fucking whop you. You really bop your bad. Alright. Come on. Invisible strain zombie. Yeah, I guess. I guess they are sort of like that. It was over 50%? Yeah, it was like 55, but you get what I fucking mean. Ha actually, Mr. Streamer? Hi. You were at 52%. Meaning you were well within the parameters you already labeled as being safe to melee. I think you're wrong. Uh-huh. I thought this was a dead animal. It turned out to just be a really ugly stump of a tree. I, I'm gonna be honest, we're probably not gonna find that chest we did last time. We'll still get to the amount of money we need, it's just it's gonna be from different stuff. Cause, um... Oh, that's creepy. Cause it, this map is hard to identify where you are until you have, like, decent, you know, tracking options. That's a whisper. That's one of those jump scare monsters. We want to avoid him. Yeah, I'm going to take this offering to Jesus for myself. Mine now. Thanks. Thanks. Yeah, those are mine now. How much am I at? 213? Okay, we get that fucking... We get that goddamn chest now. And we are... We are in the... In the goal. And then we are not fighting. We are gonna bail out of the area. And buy our perk. From the merchant. I think... It was down here this way. Because that's the... We can also open... Try opening that one for it. But this is the path I took. Let's try to not fall to my death, though, doing it. I'm just retracing my steps. Jesus would have wanted you to have it. That's what I like to think whenever I pilfer goods from, uh, you know, a holy site. Jesus would probably want it this way. He'd, he'd want to hook me up. He's a cool guy like that. He'd want me to have his stuff. Yeah. Uh, that's a whisper. I'm not sure I can shoot them. Let's see. <laughs> yeah, as expected, that's a ghost. It went right through his ghost body. Pretty easy, I'd say. They're coming! Ow! <sighs> My <sighs> mana, you dick! <sighs> At least I got this open. The mother load! Let's get out of here, chat. We're leaving. Whoa. I have 348 bucks. We're leaving. Going back from whence we came. Not getting greedy. Back over the hill. And we leave. We can't even save right now because that thing just ate all of our mana. So back up, back up and out. Please. Yeah. But yeah, I like this. I like this game a lot. I think as well because it's it's set in a very interesting weapon. Uh, it's you, Goat Chan. It's in a pretty interesting, like, gun era, so, like, the guns, it's not, like, rapid-fire shooting something. Less bullet spongy, more, like, the guy, the thing dies in, like, eight shots, really, like, the first monster. 
It's not as it's not as much like chores, you know. Pretty sure this is the way to the lake, and once we get to the lake, I know the way out. I don't want that. Tomat sucks. Yeah. Yeah. You 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 right, Chet. You right. I don't know where I am. I might be a little bit lost, Chet. But I think this is the way to the lake. <laughs> I see a clearing I'm going for. Alright, this is the lake. Once we get to the lake, I know how to get home. I think I might also be able to fast travel home. Then again, I might need a perk for that. I'm gonna check at the I'm gonna check first. No, I'm not. I'm just gonna leave. Cause I'm actually not sure. But this is for sure. Leaving leaving through the entrance is a guaranteed exit. And one that's easy to follow. Let me check the map. <laughs> I'm going the right way. We're right here. You guys actually can't see my crosshair, but we're right where I expected I would be on the map. Why is it zappy? It was just a sound effect. Come on, Jet, follow this road on out, we're free. Pulling out my sword is like monster bait, dude. I don't want to fight anything until I'm out, though. Because I don't make any money off of these kills yet. I'm only going to start making money once I buy the perk. So, like, I, that's why I was avoiding killing anything. If I could help it as well. Is that I, I ain't gaining anything for it. Am I really gonna get gatekept by like the fucking whisper demon at the exit to the map? Yes, I am. Don't fucking do it! Don't do it, I'm crazy! <laughs> Alright, asshole. Alright. Alright. Gatekeeping the exit so no one can leave. Really cool stuff. I, I would have had to go around such a gigantic detour to leave otherwise. To Belleville. The doggo though, the doggo is here now and he might even give us some like Bonuses and we save whenever we enter or leave this place Dog Chan hey, you brought me money. You're a good boy. You're a good boy Do more of that More breaking and entering whatever it takes to win To provide to provide me with that capital that dosh All right chat Bounty Hunter License. You'll get around 10 coins for every kill of an evil creature. Collect your reward from the town mayor. Easily the best perk in the game. Easily. And with that, our power has increased by an immense amount. Because we will be able to buy everything else. Next, we'll probably get Skilled Merchant. If we can, because that's just going to make everything else even better whenever we find it. But we need to get, like, a couple abilities really early, because they're only going to be really, really pay off if we get them early. And that's Skilled Merchant and um, Lockpick Master. Try to get those two early so that we can just get as much money as fucking possible. But Skilled Merchant first, since if we do it the other way around, then we will break into stuff and we'll, we'll have all the gold available and we won't even be able to spend it. I'm going to try to break open this one. I got it. Okay, so this will let me get Skilled Merchant off of one of these. Hopefully. 87. Might be exact. We might get exact change out of this. Okay. No, it's 150 for Skilled Merchant. I think. 
thief! They weren't using it. I think it's 150 for skilled merchant and lockpick is 100. No, it's 100. All right. 20% more money for each gold item we collect. Trust me. It's important. It'll be worth it. We're not going to use these. We're going to save at the church boy. We're going to let him heal us. But first, I can't get over this fucking fence. This fence is too powerful. I wanted to see if the uh, mayor would pay me, like, you know, back pay me for all the work I've already done, you know? Because technically, technically, you know, I, he hasn't paid me yet for the work. I did kill some, technically. So maybe, maybe I'll get back paid for it. Come on, man. Let me in. Hey. Okay, the answer was no. <laughs> I, I, I just checked. The answer was silence and confusion. I haven't been in here properly. Ooh, creepy. Let me just take a look upstairs real quick. Nothing like a fucking cursed doll in a chest. That wasn't exactly what I wanted. To Thanks. You fucking creepy thing. Yeah, yeah, I'm out. I wanna go. I pick up the glowstone. It allows me to glow. Inside. I'll go it fine. Fucking weird. All right, let's go. thing about that is that I, uh, okay, yeah, all right. All right. okay, hang on, I'm just gonna, hang on, I'm just gonna, okay, easy, all right, all right, he's, poof, gone, he's just, he's just somewhere, you let it out, I didn't know, I didn't fucking know. Look, chat, sometimes I just need money. And now we can make a lot more money. Him? Whatever happened with that guy? Not really our problem, frankly. How many more pick locks do I have? Lock picks, I have one. Howdy, man. Heal me. It was locked for a reason. You know what else is locked? Fucking things that hold money. Dude, I can't just worry about, like, Every fucking thing. I need the cash. I'm going up into the town barn to try to steal some more cash while I'm at it. Actually, frankly, I shouldn't use any more of the lockpicks until I have enough money. Because now we can do it the, 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 the clean way by killing monsters. And I don't even have to, like, grab anything off their bodies, chat. The mayor will just know. <laughs> Take me to the cabin. We can now automatically go to the cabin. We still have to leave naturally, I think, because we don't have the perk to fast travel from anywhere. Or whatever it is. Oh. I, need to, I don't even have enough mana to fucking tell where the monster is, because that fucking ghost... Fucking ghost drained me. He's almost assuredly back here. Come on, chat. We'll find him. We can start hunting for real now. Although, it's still a long fucking hunt fun finding this guy. He's a little shit. I wish I had my mana. I gotta find something to kill. Oh, 
Honestly, I've always found it's easier to find this guy if you let him wander out of your range again and go from there. Spooky red thing over there. Because right now I don't know where he is. I only know is like, I only know he's around me in a circle somewhere. He could be chasing after me and I could be running away from him for all I know. He's probably up the hill though. Watch this. Watch this here. Ah, yes. Well, this will get his attention, surely. Fire! Pass. Excellent. What the fuck? This didn't even- Oh, there we go. I was like, I don't give a shit about the rest of it. That made me a lot of money, Jet. That's enough to actually go back and get the lockpick thing. Which I probably should do. Hello? Get the fuck away from me! Get away from me! You are ten dollars in my bank account. Give me your fucking souls. The activating brain vision! He's by the fucking cabin! Son of a bitch! This is why you put crucifixes at the cabin. I'm an idiot for not doing it yet. I knew if I had stayed put exactly where I was, he would have come to me. That's the that's the thing with this detection. You gotta you actually just have to like stay put. Fucking thing. I don't want to shoot my gun or he'll hear me. And he'll get, like, spooked. Oh. Hey, man. Why are you running from me? Are you scared? Oh, you're still in my line of sight, motherfucker. No, wait. wait. And he's gone. He's gone. Let's tell him. This is what we trained for, chap. Little bastard went up onto a hillside. Let's trail the little shit. Get the fuck away from me. Come on. I'd like to kill that dog. I could get more mana if I did. Should probably shoot this fucking thing. I don't want to take any chances right now. Oh, there's more than one now. Yeah, pay me money for this shit. Yeah, bring more. I want more zombies to come after me. Come on. On guard. Yes. Werewolf Chan went this way. I know that without a doubt in my mind. Stay away from that. I need all my mana right now. But where? Where did he go from here? Is he in the ditch? Perhaps. Perhaps. 
Something something a blazing path is born. Excellent quotes chat all around. You guys are really fucking making me feel like I'm really in the darkest dungeon realm. Hunting monsters in the woods. Some really good stuff. I'm not exactly- I'm not hunting him that hard right now, chat, is the thing. Like, if he were to get away, yeah, I wouldn't- wait? But... Hang on. If he reappears right now... Nah, he's- he's gone. Huh? He's actually coming towards me. Wherever the fuck he is. But he's very far away. I'm not very inclined to hunt him down. When he could come to me. As he's been doing. I'm more interested in money. Right now. This early. I'm interested in cash. I want that fucking cash. Which means I want to get back to town actually. Fucking red boy. Do I want to fight this thing? Not really. I don't really want to fight red boy. Ow. I just got my ass slapped. Okay. Stop it! Stop it! That's it! Stop it! I'm gonna die. I got it. That was scary. Werewolf chan still on me. Truly not the time for this. All of you leave me alone! Fuck! Fucking God! Gotta get back to town. A million and one things trying to bring me in. It's almost like I'm being hunted instead of being the hunter. I don't much like that. Oh, he fucked off. Okay, cool. Alright, I'm gonna follow this cliffside. That'll take us back towards town. I'm gonna take the path out. Alright, so the monster's like cutting me off on the way out. We'll see how he likes that. When I show him my super swap shoot move where I shoot twice really quickly with both of my guns. I might not even need fast reload to kill this motherfucker. Where is he anyways? If the lake appears right now, I'm gonna go get him. I know where he is, he's right behind the cabin. Apparently. Is it? The fog's really coming in. I don't want to go in there. I don't want to go in that. I don't even care about getting him right now. It's not that important. It's not even on my list. I just want to get out of here. For now. It's like about like a billion bucks I need to like transfer into a like perk. Whisper Goblin. I hate the Whisper guys. They're the scary ones. Losing my mana ability is fucking as sketchy as Naked Man running at me at full sprint in a straight line. Good news is, this gun is an instant kill on anything regardless of where it is on their body. Which is pretty nice. How fucking many are there? Get out of here. Can I go home now? I'll leave. There's so many people after me, chat. They hate me. They hate me. They hate me. I don't understand what I did. 
Is that the fucking lake? It's the lake. I'm not sure if I can fast travel from the lake, but I'm gonna I'm gonna check this time. Might as well. Plus there's healing things at the lake. I know there's like a fucking there's like a barn there. It's like a whole farmland at the lake for healing. Wow, an hour of this already? Yeah, this game really flies by this game. It's really good. I like it a lot. We can also save because we have full mana, so I'm gonna hit the save spot, like an intelligent guy. Before we do anything, just in case. Oh wait, it's not the healing farm here, it's the farm at the house, at the town that I'm thinking of. Well, we can see if I can leave, real quick. Nice, I can't. Okay, so I can leave from the middle of the town. Nice. I'm out. Hey, boy. You look suspiciously evil for some reason. I don't know why. I don't know what it is about you, boy. But you got this, like, look in your eye. Like the fucking teeth. Okay, so now I have enough to buy the lockpicking thing, which is also important. Oh, he also gave us another crucifix for free now. All right, I would like... Gives you the ability to fast travel to town if you have at least 100 health, consumes 100 mana. That's such a bad ability. We just want, we want the lockpick master ability. Which boosts our chance to lockpick by 30 more percent. Because they don't actually give you, he can't, this guy doesn't sell you lockpicks, so your lockpicks are somewhat finite in this game. If you have enough times, you just won't be able to open locks anymore. So, uh, it's a good thing to get. Nice. Let's go pick up our cash. Hey, Tamto, the mayor money in all caps. Hey, I'd like to remind you, you don't need to all caps inform me of things that I of course fucking know because I literally spent half of the stream getting the ability. You're doing God's work. Thank you. Yeah, now we're gonna have a lot of money. We're gonna start rolling in it, chat. I've set up everything perfectly to make a lot of capital. Which means now we can start being the menace we should have been the first time I played this game to these monsters, chat. Cause now there's no longer gonna be a money issue. We make cash like it's fucking nothing. All right. Fill up on bullets first, just in case. Let's, um... Let's look into other perks we can buy. The expensive ones first. Fast reload. Weapons reload 30% faster again. Ooh. Increases the silver crucifix sense radius to 200 meters and damage to 200 HP. Actually the instant purchase in this case. Chat, you got, you'll understand in a minute why. We're about to be a serious asshole to this werewolf. <laughs> When we get back in today, you guys are gonna understand why he should be scared of us and not the other way around. I should heal before I go. He's just gonna be walking down the street and get hit by a fucking nuke. For quite possibly the amount of damage that my gun does now. You gonna play that old retro shooter game that was the balls? That old retro game, retro shooter game again, that was the balls. Hi. Hi, yes, it's I, Tomato Gaming, the one you're asking the question to. I'd like a, I'd like to ask for a, a redo? On that one. Because I don't understand. All right, back in the old cabin zone. All right, chat, here's how this works. Okay. 
we are going to be placing crucifixes around the map. Silver crucifixes attack your hunting target with lightning if it crosses the crucifix sense radius. Our current radius is, a, is 200 meters, which is like half of my sense radius for the werewolf itself currently. And it'll do 200 damage. And we get a free one every single time we kill 10 evil creatures in the map. So, considering the werewolf is already pretty much here, we always place one right about there. Because for some reason, the werewolf loves this spot, and he will always loiter around here to some extent. So we place one about there, and we place the other one like up on the hill over here. And then we place the third one as a wild card, like however the fuck we feel like. But we're gonna do the smart thing right now. Check where he is and probably just hang tight until he comes to us, because that looks like he's at fog zone. Which is that way. Yeah, he's coming this way towards us. He's not at the lake. He's at the. There's a zone that looks just like fog. Trust me, it's like a bunch of fog. We saw it earlier. If he was at the lake, you'd be you'd be able to see the other side from his vision. He's probably gonna come my way. This is a good place to place the other crucifix. There's fog zone. Wait, no, that's rocks. We're not exactly hunting him just yet. I'm still, I'm still trying to find a good place to place this first. He'll, he'll find himself being automatically hunted by crucifixes now. He'll die on his own once we place enough of these things. He'll just kill himself. But this side right here oh yes seems he's coming to me it's also a good place to put this crucifix he's running away from me God damn it, I'm gonna have to out myself. He's like right down the hill, but there's a red guy. Right there. <laughs> Fucking asshole. That's a full mana regen, the red boys, though. Oh, fuck you! Oh, bitch! See that shit, Chet? Look at how much damage he just took! Go to hell! The power of God! Doesn't feel good, does it? To be struck by lightning! With a perfectly min-maxed build. Oh, he's fucking crying all the way home to mommy right now. Look at how fast he's running. He's in the fog zone. Deep in the fog zone. Now I remember where it is. He hated that. You know what's the best part, chat? This, uh, these will also work for every other monster in the game. The crucifixes are just fucking incredible. And the main thing we'll be spending our money on once we have perks. I'm not that hell-bent on killing these guys with swords. All right. So he's up here. Fog zone's over this hill. Pretty sure. There's a monster around here. It's not the werewolf, it's like an ad. But those ads are free money. Oh. 
I'm, I'm like open to spending bullets on these guys because I still get paid more for killing one. So as long as I don't miss, I'm making more money from shooting these things. And I'm also staying safer because I don't need all these bullets to kill the monster. I need two. One more bullet should kill it if we find it now. So I, I'm not going to be too greedy on my ammo. Looks like he's scampering off. And this will be the last place that we put a crucifix. This is our last one. We'll probably wander right into it by this by his pathing right now, coming back in this way. He's actually coming my way. It'll take about 30 seconds for that thing to charge. And then we'll just see him get struck by fucking lightning and die. Oh yeah. He's coming right for me. I hope he does. Crucifix is up. Come on. He's totally coming my way. Chat. He's gonna get hit by this fucking thing. I'm not going after him because I want to see if he actually gets hit by this thing and dies from this. You know? Oh, he's on the hill, huh? He's above us. He's up there. Shame I can't pick you up and move you, huh? I can only destroy you. Which is not very helpful. Well, let's tail him. Let's try to find this guy. Tomato on his way to get flanked. Hey man, I don't know if you've noticed, but this werewolf is a little bitch. I'm not deeply concerned about him. I'm more worried about basic ads than I am about the werewolf. He's this way. Part of me doesn't really want to fucking... We have enough health to kill this one. Usually if we're chasing him, that means he's gonna fucking accidentally stumble his way into a crucifix. Oh, there he is. It's, pre it's truly been a pleasure, you majestic motherfucker, but it's time for you to die. Without even realizing what had happened to him. Without even realizing what the fuck just happened to him. Ow! Ow. <laughs> After everything I saw in those woods, it became clear that this monster was created by a powerful witch, and that it, that is settled in those woods. I did some research, and I think I know how to find and kill her. I've gathered some ammo for you. Thank you. Don't forget to pick it up from the table. Oh my god, this is more than I'll need. Actually, wait, no it isn't. Thanks for the we money. I'm very grateful for everything you've done. Thank you. Chat! Next up is something even scarier. And it's death. You'll see. You'll understand in time the extent of the work we must complete. Let's check in to see if there's anything new creepy in here. Since the doll moved out. You know? Thanks for the money. Fucking weird. You see, you guys see that chair move? A little bit forward. Did you guys? You guys saw that, right? I'm not just going crazy. Just wanted to make sure. 194 bucks. Let's um, 
Let's buy some more wacky tools. Yeah. Another free crucifix. Ammo bag. Worthless, in my opinion, currently. Uh, there's better stuff I can get. No, monster shout. If, un if the undead hurt you, there's a 30% chance you'll use monster shout to scare them away. I don't want them running from me. I want them to die. Improved regen sounds awesome. Pro that's probably what I'd get. Power of nature. Nah. Weapon reload is probably the best thing to get right now. See how fast I shoot now. I'm willing to spend a bullet on that. Whenever I'm out of here. All right, chat. Let's ride. We're making excellent progress. Hey, boy. Oh. Mine. That's money for me. I have yet to a lock pick this house. I'm gonna try to get into it. Let's see if I can pull it off. I'm in. Hey. All my cats are black cats, so like, this isn't even spooky to me, dude. All of them are. I can't open this, I don't know the code. All? Yeah, I used to have three. One of them, one of them was real old and died like fucking five years ago or something. But the other two, for some reason, don't age. <laughs> And they were all, they were triplets. So, the other two are like fucking ageless. And I honestly don't understand how they're still going. Because they're getting up there, dude. And I honestly, for some reason, as they've gotten older, they've gotten more active. Which is good. The other two. If there's a witch in those woods, I should be able to find the sacrificial tree. That tree is active when it rains. So it becomes possible to find it using my ability. Destroying that tree should make the witch vulnerable and less powerful. Now I know what you're thinking. Tree? What do you mean, sacrificial tree? <laughs> I've, there's a spook over there. Hit him! Got him, you motherfucker, where are you? <laughs> yeah, that's right! This ain't loaded. There he goes, baby! <laughs> there he goes! That's the, that's our boy! That's our boy, folks! That's our boy! That's the target of the night! Yeah, it's gonna be a long hunt this eve, Chet! He's so fast. Yeah, but it won't help him. He's slow. He hides in a place, he doesn't know what to do. He's awake. Why is he scared of us? They're all scared of us because we have guns, dude. And most monsters in the real world would probably be scared of guns. Crucifix will go right here on the other side of the lake. An excellent spot for it tonight. He's got a lot of HP compared to the last guy. That's fine, because I have a lot of bullets and a lot of money. We'll spend our entire kit, and then we'll head on back and do it again. They retain their health if you go home, so don't worry about, like, leaving and coming back and that shit, so. Good news is, chat, this guy is extremely fucking easy to load. He doesn't move, really, once he's found a spot. The trick is just finding him. Little bastard. Cause he does look just like a tree does. He might still be scampering though. He's still scampering. He's trying to find a place to hide. It's like playing prop hunt, but with just trees. I get the feeling he's over this hill. Classic. Yeah. Well, 
I'm gonna go down to that fucking campfire, because I definitely haven't gone there yet. That'll give me four more lockpicks. I think that's the tree right there. Can't say for sure, though. It might not be. Are you winning, son? Yeah. Thanks for asking. Uh... This ain't the campfire. This ain't the campfire. Where the hell are we? I don't know what the fuck that means. I think we're in the top left right now. Hello? What were you thinking would happen? Would happen like that? Really, guys? Stop that! Stop that! What were you thinking would happen? Dude, if I saw if a plant came alive and fucking like tried to like even looked at me at all, dude, I'd kill it on the spot. Like, just because it's so shocking that I genuinely can't... Like, if it came alive, I was, like, looking at me. It was like, hey. That would be, like, a... That would be an instant fucking, like, slam. Without hesitation, dude. Like, fuck that, dude. Like, stay in your goddamn lane. We water you, and you stay quiet, and you don't act like you're alive. Like, you just sort of slowly do your thing. If you start, like, talking like the rest of us, I, I'm gonna freak out. So that's gonna be... That's gonna be straight into the ground. Well, I don't think the tree is near the chasm. Oh, how long's... How long's this been here? What is this fucking thing? It smells like a teleportation potion. Ma'am. Thought I was gonna die there. I took a sip of the teleportation potion, which teleported me very far away from the monster and onto the side of a sheer cliff. I'm not sure exactly why I did that, but I was curious what it would actually do to me. If it would do something funny. But, uh, now we know. Now we know for the future. I need to get that perk that tells you where I am on the map now. I think that would be the most helpful thing. Yeah, we're back by, uh, we're back by the town, uh, fast travel point, which is good. Cause I'm probably gonna take it. Never mind. I'm instead going to continue to kill. So has he just stopped moving? God damn it! Son of a bitch! Fuck! Shit! Fucking! God damn! He's like walked over, he's like, someone shot my plant. Someone shot my baby boy. Whatever, I know where he is. And I'm gonna get him. What's he hunting now? Big tree. I'm, hun I'm hunting big tree, chat. It's a very large fucking tree, is what it is. I'm getting blurry vision. I think I was too tired or something. What we're really hunting though is small prey, like small fries. We want money from killing ads, is what we want. Nothing else really matters this early, even now. Uh, Goat Chan. Did you make that happen? Did you just spawn a bunch of monsters around me that forgot to aggro me? I think he did. I'm getting pretty good at killing these things. I'm getting I'm getting pretty pretty fucking mean. Chat? 
That's wi that's not th those aren't the whisper guys. Those are like extra spooks that the witch makes. I'm pretty sure. So they're not they're not the same level of concerning. And I think that's a I think I think we're getting close to our boy here. We follow the road from here. Unless he's been moving. God damn it! Find a place to chill. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I just saw. He just showed me. A, he just showed me like the. All right. I guess I'm following the. I think he just outed himself as on the river still. I'm gonna. <laughs> Hang on. I think he made a mistake. I swear to God, I just saw the river during that. Map it round to you still. For now. Stupid fucking tree. Don't be mean to him. I'm allowed to be mean to him because I'm hunting him down to kill him. But you guys? I think not. I don't think I actually got the mana from that guy. My powers. <laughs> He's actually, believe it or not, coming towards me. All right, he just looks like, oh fuck, he's watching. Hang on, look at these trees. He just paused. I. All right, so he's stationary now. Somewhere in this direction. Ah oh, fuck! He's froze up. Come here, tree chain. There's fucking no reason to try to. Ch All right, really, two hits there. Fucking prick. He didn't even drop mana. So I'm looking for something that looks like a pile, a much larger pile of tree than usual. Is sort of what what this is gonna look like as we get closer. Now it's gonna be extremely obvious. Believe it. And that's because it looks like a guy. Uh, it looks like a sort of. It looks a little bit like a guy is what it looks like. And I would say it's probably this one that looks like two fucking supple legs. Yeah. Ow! Fuck! <laughs> so he's gonna try to shoot me with his poison move. I need to wash away the acid at the water or get a healing plant. Cause he's he spit me with it. Good news is I can do both at the same time right here. Ow. Ooh. Careful now. There we go. Yeah, this thing will actually fight back a little bit. Oh nope. He's bugging out. Wait, he's actually just like sort of wobbling away. He doesn't he, he must have thought he just won that. Fucking asshole. Alright, chase him. After him, Chet. He doesn't even know we're after him. He thought he lost us. He doesn't know for a second that we're right on his tail. Yeah, that's right! I'm still here! Motherfucker! I'm being chased by, like, the witch's screech. Oh, that's a fucking zombie coming right for me. Oh, that girl got fucking destroyed! Get away from me, the fucking witch thing! Back to the water now. 
goat chance just watching. We got about a third of the way down. That's pretty good for a first run. Uh. <laughs> water. We gotta actually get to the water. I'm in a little bit of danger right now. <laughs> Fucking acid skin. <sighs> he's lost interest. Oh, wait, no, he's coming after us, which is in our best interest, frankly. This is actually the best position we could ask for him to be in with us. Stuck against a tree. Bunch of zombies every once in a while running at us. Slowly walking towards a ditch. Unless he kills us. He might be trying to kill us right now. But currently, this is a really good spot to get some free hits in. Cease this. I'm gonna run down the river. Fuck off! I give up! You win! Cease this. It's the yelling that pisses me off the most. Really? Really? Oh yeah? I fucking hate that little guy. I hate that little guy. Whatever, we we, we saved right before I started chasing after him at the beginning there. So we're, we're good either way. We lost a little bit of progress, but I saved literally as he was walking away from me. Though it seems like his character has moved a little bit more than before. This is probably for the best. All right, what do you do? Let's just figure it out. <laughs> ah, yes. Okay, well, now we know. Do not let that touch you. Don't, uh, don't let that one get you. We did pretty good damage though. He wasn't he wasn't running. Which made it pretty easy to get those hits in. I would like some healing though. But I would also like some money. Yeah, looks like we've lost him. I'm gonna leave it that way. Because we did just find him again. There he is. <laughs> there he is. Mm-hmm. What's happening? Oh, that's that's exhaustion. Can you plant a crucifix on him next time he stops? Technically, yeah. Technically. Was that the witch wailing? Yeah, the witch has a move that like summons those fucking things. And now that like now that I'm on her radar, she's summoning things to try to kill me faster because she's scared of me. She's a coward. I get it. I get it. I'd be scared of me too. Have you guys seen my moves? They're wacky. I've got some good shit. But yeah, this is pretty much gonna be a fight of hunt him down and machine gun blast him. Well, he gets like angrier and angrier at us. It's gonna take a little bit, but with more, it gives us plenty of time to make as much money as we want. That said, it is about time I go back to base and buy even more perks. And probably buy a thing that doubles my regeneration. Because that sounds pretty nice. With how much damage I'm going to be taking during this phase. If we're not near the water, I'm going to need plants near me to actually heal. So, uh, yeah, we want ways to heal faster, passively. As we fight this fucking asshole. I want to take this. Back to Belleville. 
Chat, you guys are being weird. Don't make me, don't, don't, don't make me, don't make me de weird the chat. Don't make me. You'll, you'll make me and you won't like what that means. Hey man, pay me. Good yeah. work. Me ammo too. Okay, we get an extra couple crucifixes, well, one. Let's buy the Improved Regeneration book for real cheap. It's a nice cheap one, but I'm not done. I'm not done. I ain't complete with this. I want the ammo bag now. Double my ammo carry weight so I can grab the rest of those. And then I want to buy... this shadow, which will make enemies, it'll make it harder for enemies to see me. Compass? Why the hell would I need a compass? The stars are my- oh, it's, it is storming right now. The stars were my compass. Up until today. Hold it. Okay. The stars were my compass. I sort of want to check if Spooky House is still spooky, but we'll check it once I'm done killing the beast. Again. Dog Chan, you got any treasure for me? No? Okay. T everyone knows the fucking sign in Belleville that just says cabin. Everyone loves that one. The only fucking notable location in the entirety of Belleville is, of course, cabin. I never grabbed the ammo. But then again, it's not a big deal. Because most of the time, it'll incur so much damage after spending 20 shots, it will want to go home anyways. Man, he's hauling right now. It's almost not worth trying to guess which way he's going yet. Unless we see him crossing this threshold right here. Or this way. <laughs> he hates me, dude. I bet I bet he's starting to realize how much this is going to start sucking for him soon once I no longer need perks and I can just spend all my money on crucifixes. It's going to really start like it's really going to start setting in how fucked these guys are when the entire map is just crosses that are zapping everyone. I microwave cereal with the milk, said someone in chat. Why would you say that though? But why? But why would you say that? Tree man's around these parts. It's actually worth just shooting the dog, because, uh... Otherwise, it fucking runs. It's still running. The hell's your problem? Don't D colon, that's ten dollars, chat. I do I do a hell of a lot more heinous shit in this game for ten bucks. If it meant taking out the evil. My energy. I gotta get the stamina boo uh boost. Pretty bad. This ain't Stonehenge. This is a different one. So, let me look at the map first. Okay. Alright, I know where I am. More lockpicks. So. Tree Chan. Okay, I see that you're by some trees. I see. Alright, well as long as he doesn't move, I should be able to sort of figure out where he is. 
Uh, wait. Wait a minute. No, that's not him. It's him. <laughs> He's uh he's in he's in this pile. He's he's positioned himself right next to this uh tree house. Hang tight a second, bud. Give me a sec. One second, sir. It's a good place to shoot this guy from. Not like any monsters can get me. Yeah, you hate you should not have positioned yourself right here, bud. He's like, maybe he what? I don't know where he is. I think he might get confused and just stay here. Oh my god. I'm about to burn through a lot of this boy's health if he's this dumb. Unless the screams can get to me here. You think they can travel vertical? I don't think so. He's slowly slipping away. <laughs> I would deserve it. Because I fully plan on spending all my ammo here otherwise. Until he's out of sight. Wow, there's poor fucking tree, man. It's gonna be a good save point, too. There's one right there. Yeah, I'm gonna burn this fucking tree's whole career. Yeah, damn right, motherfucker. Does that tree look like it's pissing or am I losing it? No, but we are getting a look at its fat ass right now. It's fat tree ass. Reloading and rifle, reloading the rifled musket with inhuman speed. 60 p maximum speed right now, chat. This guy's been killing monsters for a long fucking time, you can tell. Can't wait to jump out of this fucking house and get my neck snapped by a ghost. After I've killed this thing. I, chat, I'm not even joking. I am gonna fucking kill it right now because this is- this took a lot- this was like three- this last time was also about three hours of work for me killing this thing last time. So if I get this out of the way, then we're back up to where I was last time in about a fraction of the time. I- uh, I take it in a fucking instant, the freebie. You kidding me? I'd take this freebie in an instant with how much work it takes to fucking catch this guy otherwise. I will whittle him down all the way to like zero health. Short stream? A nice four hour stream, chat. Unless the witch ends up being fucking ridiculous, which is incredibly possible. She, I don't have any experience fighting. So she could be fucking stupid as all hell. But I fought the tree. I'm not above just taking him out. With a couple of freebies, it's his fault for not wanting to attack a treehouse. Chat, honestly, this is mental. This is psycho. The reason he's not fighting me right now, chat, is because I'm performing massive psychological warfare on the poor guy. He's thinking that a tree right now is shooting him, and he doesn't understand why that's happening. He's like, why? Ow! I'm afraid to jump out of this window. I'm actually like legit scared of what's gonna happen when I try to leave at the end of this. So if I kill him, I will be teleported out and I won't have to leave and I won't instantly be killed by the monsters camping me at the bottom of the ladder. So I'm hoping I have enough to, I'm not, I'm gonna be short one bullet chat, that's the thing. That's the fucked up part about all this. Unless. It should still be in range! This is it, baby! In 30 seconds, he's about to get lit up! Let's watch the fireworks! Look at him. He doesn't even know. Ah! Shit!
What a time! That's his nose and face. Ah! Pathetic. Let's save my game. The witch is now on the prowl, Jet. The witch is now actually about to spawn kill me. The witch is literally coming for me right now. I have two bullets. Three bullets. Let's just... Let's just... Let's just get home. Tell the mayor that we took care of another monster. And avoid witch chan. Objective, escape. The fog fields, of course. These aren't active anymore, so I don't think... Pretty sure the witch may or may not hunt you down in this level chat, so... Uh... Well, partially why I'm moving at a somewhat quick speed. Decent chance she and her merry goons will now be... I have to go. I have to leave. I saved, but like even still. <laughs> I just want to find the lake, dude. Oh, we, we lost her. We lost her, and town's right here. We lost her. She was snooping around for us, but we lost her. Back to town. An excellent job at Belleville. An excellent job done today, chat. Why are you decoding? That was like a dragon. Or like a gargoyle. Why are you like, ah, oh, fuck, you really. Uh, you guys buds? You buds? You friends with him? I was like, there's a dead guy in here. He's definitely not sleeping. Yeah. Yeah. That guy's dead. Dead as shit. I think the mayor will pay me for uh, the murder of that tree. Hey, man. Legends will be made about your fight with that horrible creature. Yeah, now give me money. Good work. Thanks. Was that for killing the other monsters and not... Fucking asshole, are you kidding me? I did all that! And you give me $48 and a slap on the back. And ass. $43 fucking dollars. Unbelievable. Good staircase. Hey man. 82 bucks. Give me another silver crucifix. Now, Watcher Totems, uh, allow me to basically look at... Yeah, they basically tell you what way the monster's facing. It also doesn't get updated. These things are such a waste of fucking money. That's so bad. Yeah, we ain't buying that. I think I'm gonna get second chance. No, I sort of want this. I want metal armor. Boost my HP. It's also a quick save. What have I ever needed to quick save in this game so far? Either you get bopped or you don't. I don't need a quick save for that. I'm gonna check Creepy House quick, see what's going on. It's because you cheesed it? Chat. You sort of cheese him regardless. Hey, what the fuck is that about in there? Wait a minute, what is that? Yo. Yo, you see that thing? 
I want in there. A creepy house, Stu. Still just as creepy as last time. Every day a little bit creepier. Every fucking time. A little bit more spooky. Alright. Chair is gone. Now the chair got slid up to the desk real nice and polite like. Come on. We got hunting to do, Chet. The witch. Is next. First of all, we don't have any active crucifixes right now, I don't think. So let's just start dropping some down. One at home base is always nice. All right. Time to find an old lady and kill him for the good of the world. I found her. I got that old. I can smell them a mile away. They smell old, chat. That's the thing about the olds. They've got this special smell, this smelly smell. He's on the mountain top straight ahead of us. By the cross. They've got this smelly smell. You'll, you'd know what I mean. Trust me. Now, I don't know how to fight a witch. But I can tell you one thing, I'm gonna at least try. Kinda looks like she's flying. Nah, she's walking around like a freaky weirdo. She was here. She carried on this way. Fucking red boys. This is gonna be a bitch to get this guy right now. Got him behind this tree, I think. Oh, he's over there. Yeah, he had to die. Back up the hill, possibly towards me because I shot a gun. Good, that's what I want, Granny. Where are you at? This is a nice flat place. There she is. That's her right there. That's not a whisper, that's her. Right by those rocks. Locked on. Load our ammo. Note the healing potions here. Oh, you teleport behind me, you fucking little you, you bitch! You bitch! Ah! Stop it! She's walking towards me! She's turning green! She's summoning plants to- Ow! Oh, she's summoning these plants! Oh. Uh, there's, a, there's a healing plant up on the fucking rocks! I gotta get back up there! She's wily, that old lady! Ow! The fuck did she go? She teleported by me! I wasn't ready for the teleport. She knew exactly what was coming. She's smart. 
too smart for her own good. Fuck you, Granny! Yeah, what good will the screaming do for you? What the hell's that? Thing? Oh, Jesus! You fucking psycho! You're living here illegally! You don't have a permit to live in this forest! And I'm on a rock! Ow! Oh, my brain! My brain! Too close for too close for me, bitch. Too close. Okay, listen here, Granny. What the fuck was that? Fuck you! Wow. We might need some quick save totems after that. She was getting too close to me. I let her get too close. She's not that bad. No. I could, I could, we can take her. We can take her, it's not that bad. Her, the plant phase was scary, but the rest of it's easily avoidable. Though I'd say I probably want to get some more money and get the stamina boots. And maybe a quick save totem or two. I'm gonna see if I can get her back up on that hill again, cause that was a really good spot to fight her. Lots of clearing. Would be better than getting caught out here, for sure. Problem is that she's definitely smart enough to come after me. Which I honestly wasn't ready for. Just get a hundred more crucifixes. True, true. One's going right up on the top of this hill. Beautiful place for it, Granny, wouldn't you agree? Okay. Oh, she summoned the trees. These things track my fucking movements really, really well. There's plants around here to use, but like, I don't want to be anywhere near these fucking things. Didn't like that, did you, Granny? Oh, she, oh, she's doing, she's doing the yell thing. Okay, so when that happens, I just have to run. I didn't recognize the, the, the sign. If I hear that roar, I just have to book it. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. I have to run as fast as I hear that thing. As fast as I can run when she's screaming. Okay. One more trip to the hill. We know where she is. I have a headache now. It's a lot of visual effects, but I like it. I think it's okay. I think if you're a little, I think that maybe if you're a little bitch, you can't handle visual effects and sound effects. Maybe you shouldn't be out here hunting with the rest of us brave boys. Maybe you just, maybe you're just a little bitch and you should go back to like knitting. Hmm? I'll be here hunting evil monsters. Yeah. Come on, Granny. She cometh. She is extremely quick. Is there a fucking red boy here? That sucks. Where is he? Oh, he's so far away. I probably just shouldn't get too greedy with my hits. Like, I should get a hit or two and then bail out again. Like, I should probably be leaving now. Okay, that was a full sprint for me. Uh. Fucking red boy. I'm gonna start circling back towards the cabin. Kite her over that way. And probably fast travel to leave. Fuck. Uh. Fuck. These fucking things. Okay. Q. 
feet of the fucking trees behind me. We're gonna head towards the lake. She's teleporting in front of it. Might be dead. I'm alive. Holy shit. Granny, you gotta calm down. It's really not that big of a deal. Oh my god, she's summoning more of the fucking plants on top of it. This is a lot, Chet. But the lake's right here. I'm probably gonna cut my losses and bail. I got a whisper on me, too. <sighs> Jesus! Stop it. All of you. Fucking skull fireballs and shit. <laughs> These things are easy to dodge. It's like a fucking real boss fight this time, dude. What the shit? <laughs> We're in my turf right now. I just saved the game. Did you see that? I, I used god powers. Let's tango, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, whatever, I just saved. She used her strongest move like point blank, I didn't have a chance. I didn't stand a fucking chance. How did I miss that? She's a slow old lady. I think she can get kept like, oh my God. You made a grave error coming here. Ow. <laughs> okay, maybe these aren't as good for dodging as I thought they were. She hates fences. Oh, she hates fences. Yeah, you like this, you fucking creepy little goat fuck? She hates fences. <laughs> she hates ice and fire both. Okay. about that time to hit the old fucking signpost and get on out of this place. What do you guys think, chat? Feels like about that time we go like, oh, time to leave. <laughs> and leave. And come back and finish her off on the next one. Do I better skedaddle? Now that I know chat, now that I know that she is the aggressor, I'm going to I'm going to fucking put 30 crucifixes at the house and I am just going to explode her in one hit. Because apparently I can bait her to like wherever the fuck I want. So why wouldn't I just like buy a bunch of fucking crucifixes and explode her? You're much more advanced witch hunter than the last time. I've learned. I told you guys I became better at video games. You can probably tell. Give me my free one. You tell me I didn't kill three monsters while I was there? You're lying. Let's see what the mayor thinks. How about that? You fucking asshole. I'm ascended. See, the thing is that I don't think the ads that she was making counted for my money, is the issue. Like, I was supposed to make some money out of that, but I don't think I'm getting paid for the ones. Hey. Excellent job. Okay, that other guy's just ripping me off, I guess. Whatever, it's not a big deal. I killed 15 guys while I was out there. We actually need to buy ammo now is the thing. Cause uh We are not gonna get 
Yeah, we're actually gonna need, like buy 30 rounds or so to kill to kill her. So we can spend another two, three on crucifixes. We don't need many more perks, I don't think. I was thinking I might need the stamina one, but turns out I don't need it to outrun her. And most of the other perks are sort of like just quality of life shit. I'd rather spend the rest of them on exploding this witch at the camp when I get there. And what mayor still? No, we already got that. All right, so I'm just gonna do like a fucking wacky and a one and a two and a three. And if she comes here, she's going to get triple bopped by like a super laser. Which might just level her in one hit. Honestly, that'll do 600 damage, which is about six bullets worth, which might actually kill her. Or at least put her down to like a tenth of her health left. Apparently she can just be kited places once I find her. So there's not much really telling me that I can't just, you know, lead her all the way here. You gotta fuck off, though. I don't want you here anymore. Go on. Get. Get. Ha ha wee. Uh. Ha! Help me, goat friend! Where you going? Where you going? Ah. Oh, shit. Why'd you just watch? She comes. Let's see if she has the guts to come near my house today. Here, lady. I'm right here. Just setting a bait shot to see if she takes it. Yes. Yes. Well, I know that she's up here. Same cliffside as last time. So I guess I'll go get her. I've started to realize the pistol is a far superior weapon. Seems like its range doesn't really fall off at all. Like, there's no damage fall off in the game. So using the rifle is just like a better aim, like a better sight. But like, I don't need that, really. Just line it up with the top there and you got it. Zombie chair. The witch will come to me at a certain range. If I get back on top of the hill. Hell, she might even attack me right here again. That might be her. health though but I think there's healing plants around here oh she's actually left my range which means she's probably about to get hit by my fucking lightning if anything that's usually how this works she's left my range she's at the other mountain across the way she likes hanging out on hills a lot she's over on that side right now I think. So she was up here, she crossed down. Come here. Yeah, that's right, you. Didn't stand a fucking chance. You wanna know why? Because I have tape drawn across my monitor, so I always know where the center of my monitor is for a crosshair. Even if there isn't one in the game, because the game didn't give me it. I always know. I've ruined my whole fucking monitor for this. I used, like, Sharpie. And a ruler. And a protractor. It was an extremely expensive monitor, completely ruined, so that I could be better at gaming. Actually, I'm pretty sure this monitor does have a fucking tool in it that lets you paint a crosshair on the monitor, even if the game doesn't give you one. And I find that one of the most wildly pathetic fucking things I've ever heard of in my entire life. And it's so bad because it not only turns on, but also doesn't have an off switch. So like, fuck dude. 
most do. Isn't that like just pathetic though? Do you really need it that badly? You can't just feel it out, dude, you know? I feel it out, man. I feel the spot, you know? I can sense it a mile away. Also, it's not that hard to do that. I'm just gonna keep hunting monsters. The more crucifixes I can stack in the middle, even if I can't find her, the better. You just said you had a crosshair. I don't know what to believe in anymore. Why do I ever try fucking getting that guy with anything other than a bullet? Fuck him. He's straight up leaving. He'll be back. He'll be back. Dog chat. Yeah, he'll be back in no time. I don't know where that witch went, but I'm not very inclined to chase her up hills really far away from my base, considering I figured out the safest way to fight her is at my house. If I felt confident enough, I probably could have just beaten her in one. You're not perfect. Damn right I'm not. She's coming. You think she'll buy it? You think she'll come here? She's right there. No, that's not her. She's coming down the hill, back towards the homestead. Coming back towards the homestead. So is this the Boston experience? No, I don't remember anyone in Boston needing to fucking hunt down a witch, though. That's not really a Boston thing. But I do this all the time out in, uh, out where I live. She's fucking off again. She's going back up the hill. She loves that hill. I should have put these all on the hill. Fucking hell. I know which way she's going. I'm tailing her. Because these are the rocks from the clearing that she just passed. She's real close, Chet. The problem is, will I be able to find my way back to the house if I aggro her here? I could probably kill her regardless. Where is she right now? Fucking mountain top, unbelievable. Okay, well now she's about to go down it again. She really likes that fucking hill. A lot. Though I'm tempted just to keep on killing things and get enough money to make a fucking nuke at my house. I just don't want to miss it, you know? I think she's up this one. Nope. Wrong. Yeah, you hated that, didn't you? You fucking thing. Yeah, you hated that. Fuck you, creepy little gargoyle. Probably telling on me. To the witch. Corpse is on the other side of the river. It's not like I even want it. I can't get it. 
Ow. It's very cold in the water. That was a me. That was a victory for me, you know. That was a win for me. All right. Let's go back to let's let's go hunt some more like ads, make some more money, continue to make like our like nuke. I hear something over here. Oh, yeah. Oh, I missed it. Son of a bitch! Come on! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> yeah, that brought her down about a fucking fourth of her health in one. Chat, for context, how's she feeling right now? Ow, 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 ow! <laughs> one missed? No, two stacked on top of each other. You tell by how much damage it did. First one did much more damage. That was not close to a tenth. No, she was at about a third left. She's now at about a tenth left. So, by that logic, did about two tenths ish. She's near. It's time that we end this hunt, chat. So much wrong. Dude, what if I did that to you right now and I just said you're wrong? See how see how this works? That guy's wrong. I'm gonna just hunt her down and kill her. I think. She's probably up the mountain. She's got like a fucking heart on for the mountain lifestyle. She probably was like, ow, I need to get air, and then like ran up, ran up here again. She's near. Which is near. Activate supervision. What the fuck? Hey! Why isn't she in the fucking mountains where she always is? She's looping back to the house, I think. Oh god. Oh god. She's doubling back towards the cabin. I think she wants another round. She's avoiding you? Yeah, I mean like three more shots and she's dead. I'd avoid me. I should honestly go to the cabin and save. I'm gonna do that quick. Cause if I don't, and she kills me, I'm gonna lose all that progress we just made on her. I don't think I have enough mana to do it right now. I should go over and... Oh, there she is. Hang on. She's about to teleport to me in one second. No, she's still actually out of my range. Nope. Nope, there she is. Oh, fuck off! Try to take her back to my house. Perfect. Perfect. You're lucky I don't have any mana. Or you'd be double dead. We'll have to do it the old fashioned way. Bam! Ow. I really hate that red guy's still around, dude. Ah. Oh, he's right here. That made this easy. Thanks for the mana, bud. You're so fucked that your buddy just seriously did that for me. You're so dead now. Hang on, let me just hit that save point so I can end this. Bam! Ow! Oh. Oh. oh, fuck 
the plant ones. I hate this phase. I hate these guys. They they're like they have like tracking bullets. It's cold in the water too. All right, that's it. She's summoning plants again. That's it. I'm gonna cleave her in twine. Chat. Oh God! All right, I need one more bullet on her before. <laughs> Alright, I need I need one more shot on her before I cut her. Just like grab me and snap my neck. <laughs> Ow. Stop it. Is it time? No, not yet. I need the one more. I missed it. I can't believe that was the most stationary she's been fucking ever and I missed her. But the evil is defeated. The game is over. Honestly, didn't stand a fucking chance. Yes. <laughs> I didn't finish them off. Just want to give him one more bullet, make sure. Upon further examination of the witch's body, we came to the conclusion that she recently gave birth to a child of the devil. Oh, good. It explains why Undead is still roaming the forest and why she was so aggressive. I need to find and destroy it before it grows stronger or it will become unstoppable. Killing that witch is a major victory. Thanks. Unfortunately, it seems that even more people in Belleville are gone. Pretty much everyone's dead. I hope you will be able to find and kill that son of a bitch before it's too late. Okay. Pay Good me. work. Thank you. Don't worry, Mayor. If there's one thing I know how to do, it's murder. Everything. I got this. Wow, it has gotten very dark. Is dog okay? Hey, boy. You're all right. You're all right. Mayor is probably evil. Oh, without a doubt, they're all evil. Oh, they're all gone. Everyone in the town is gone, other than... This fucking thing. <laughs> Alright. Hee <laughs> What about shopkeeper? You still here? Yeah, you better be. I'm gonna need a lot of, I'm gonna need a lot of bullets for this little shit kid, all right? So you're gonna have to hook me up with the whole package. Come on, all right. I wanna run faster. I want iron legs. And, and I want another silver crucifix. Stay safe now, I'll be back. I will defeat the monster. Don't worry. Maybe I can go inside spook room? No. No. Is house still incredibly haunted or what? I remember this being broken last time, that's all. Hey! Thanks for the money, gang. I'm putting that towards the crucifix fund. Has Chair completed its quest? I wish I knew. The chickens are laughing at us. Listen to them. Listen to them. They're all laughing. We have to end this. Fuck. You could just spot me five dollars, dude. After all I've done? Unbelievable. Let's see if the cat's okay. Remember that was that cat over here? Cat 
that's gone. Too bad I don't know the code to this safe. Ooh. Now I got the money for the for the next one. Alright, let's go buy that last one. I don't know if we're gonna be looking for like a small baby, medium-sized goblin, fucking pile of goop. It honestly could be anything. So crucifix is probably safe. That'll hit anything. It's the goat, I bet. Probably should have killed that goat. Definitely think that might have been a good like a good call to shoot that thing earlier than this. But hey, what am I? It's too risky to go at night, but it needs to be killed as soon as possible. Or it will become too strong. I can handle this. How bad can it be? Alright! Come on out! I don't want to tell you you're in grave danger if you fucking don't come out of here right now. But you... He's, uh, moving pretty quick. I'm gonna go ahead and toss down some of my security crucifixes. He comes. Hey! Stop that! Stop that, you fucking psycho! Jesus! Stay away from me, it's gonna explode! You're making a big mistake! Ow! Okay, he's very fast. That's a very fast boy. <laughs> I didn't stand a chance. My bullets weren't even loaded. I didn't I couldn't shoot him away from me. Fuck that guy. Little shit zoomer. Let's see how he likes this. I'm still here. Oh, now you, now you're a little shy. Now you're shy. It's okay, chat. The power of Christ will protect us. How can you beat this other than crucifix spam? I get the weird feeling that he's spooked uh, by bullets the same way Werewolf Chan was. But we wouldn't have been able to test that because our bullets weren't loaded. And I panicked. Man, this place got fucking dark and scary. He's actively running at me. No, he's not. Yes, he is. He's tailing me. He's chasing me as fast as he can right now. Where even is the house, Chet? I'm a little scared to go out there. It's a little dark and he's zooming. But I think he was actually just walking somewhere. Is your psychosis acting up again? It's not psychosis. It's real personal fear. Because there's an angry baby in the woods. And they're upset that I killed their mom and pets. hill climbing just like his just like his old mom he's up on the mountain <laughs> it's 
so hard to tell where I am. I need to get the compass thing, but I don't think there's any monsters spawning in this fucking realm anymore. So I'm sort of out of, out of luck on that one. So I can't make any money anymore, so I can't get the fucking... Okay, there's still this creepy fucking thing. So I guess monsters are still real. Oh, that pissed him off. Oh, Jesus! Stop it! Okay, he's like the werewolf. You just revealed your weakness to me, boy! Oh, you hate being shot! Big mistake, scampering off like that. Should've stood your ground, cause now I know what you're about. Also, if we, if we lured him to my house, chat, he would actually instantly die. Is what would happen. Um, if he was at the house, he would be instantly exploded by the power of Christ. That would be fucking insta-kill on him. I guess I'm gonna go after her. Or do I? He's currently just walking by some rocks. It's taking a moment. Yeah, I mean, like... Hello? I'm more inclined to chase the sounds of monsters than I am to try to get him just yet. Because these are cash. I make money off of these. I sort of need the money. He is innocent. I don't know if you guys noticed the first time I, I spawned in, when he chased after me, slapped me in the ass about 30 times, ripping my ass off and killing me. While I screamed, help, someone stop him. So I don't think he's as innocent as you think he is. Definitely got an Antichrist vibe going on. I think Zoomer skeletons around here. Red boy over there, I'm gonna kill him. Stop it. There he is. Not right now. Can't fucking see him through like the brush here. Get real close to him like this. Really? You're a quick, freaky little bastard. All right, got it. Yeah? Yeah? won't be coming back. I wish I could kill the dogs fast enough to insta. Because most of the time these things just fuck off once I get hit. That means I don't make any money. Let's try to get back to the house. I think, chat, what I do is I just continue with spamming crucifixes by the cabin until this little bastard just comes back to the house. And we instantly kill him. I think that's what I really want to have happen. But currently I'm lost. I don't have a compass. So I don't know where I am. It's dark. Sort of cold out. I'm sleepy. No one's giving me any directions. I thought this stump was a bear for a second. But it was just a stump. Keep hearing these weird hissing sounds. That can't be good. 
I see a cave on the, I've never been here. Man, I've never actually been to this cave. What is this? Hello? This guy's dead as shit. New skill, fast travel. Gives you ability to fast travel in town if you have at least 100 health. Consumes 100 mana. That's pretty rad. I never paid for that, so that's good. Well, that's useless. Not really, considering I'm lost. Pretty helpful for literally the situation I'm in right now, if you actually think about it. Do you get mana from killed enemies? Yes, that's the blue shit. That's why I run over them whenever I kill them. Who would have thought I would become completely lost and unable to find my way? God, I'm fucking hungry, dude. As soon as I beat this fucking game, dude, making, get, going to that, gonna order something from that fucking premium, really nice. Uh. Ah! <laughs> Does it feel too good to feel the wrath of God, huh, motherfucker? Don't like that, do you? Uh, uh, what's he, wait, what's he doing right now? Oh, he's, he's taking a swim after that. <laughs> I would too. I would too. So it looks like he went into the... Looks like he went swimming? He's going swimming? Dude, frankly... I don't really want to pursue him right now. Dude, I need to get over there to get the mana? I think I aggro the whisper first. Uh, this guy's a full mana thing. I want to fast travel out. We'll deal with. We'll deal with. Oh, I'm low on health still. Fuck. I'm healing. We'll deal with the. We'll deal with the kids' swim lessons after this. I'm getting heartbeats even though I know I'm nowhere near him. Which is sort of spooking me. That's giving me like a little bit of a spook. Right now. Also, the fog is lifted. Like the weather's clearing. But I know he's not dead. I absolutely want to save before I go near the lake right now. Is the thing. But I don't think I'm gonna get that chance. Yeah, fuck you! Do it to hell! Alright. The sun is rising on this long night. Chat. We've been in the darkness for so long. Oh, looks like we're actually heading away from the lake then, right now. I want to find a save point, is all. Okay, so this is the way to the lake. There should be healing flowers around these plant, these rocks here. There always are. Okay, almost there. Once we're there, I'm gonna fast travel out, save. It'll save when I do that. And uh, come back with another billion fucking tools. To town. To town? The child can wait for one more moment. I'm sure they're fine. They're probably drowned. They're probably drowned in the water or something. Hey, man. The body's gone. And there's a dead bird out here. I don't care. I'm gonna collect my money. Pay me. Good work. Thank you. Kisses. Still can't get into these fucking rooms. Nothing else spooky ever happens in this house anymore. 
This place is just a normal house now. It's not even that scary. Alright. Let's buy a couple more fucking zap totems, just in case. Who knows? Oh, someone also took down the hanging lady. Yes, excellent. Very good is how I would describe what just happened. And we've saved a lot on mana too. Well, uh, ammo. We got a lot of resources for this. Whatever this kid throws at us, we're gonna be ready for it. And I say in order to do this the right way, we teleport directly there, fast traveling to take away all the suspense of whatever's about to happen in that lake, let's go. So where are you at now? You like in there? You want me to... You want me to like come out? Yeah, wait, let me wait a second. Let me just... Let me just give those one second to cool off. Just give me one sec. I just, I just need to give the, need to give the crucifixes a second to heat up. Before I... That was a very big mistake. You should not have surfaced. You stupid fucking fish. That was a big mistake. Alright. So where are you- Where's the sign? The sign's gone. Oh, he's just looking at me. The sign's gone. I can't- Ow! Stop that! Right now! I get the weird- Oh, I see. Wait, do I see? What is this? What are you, a boss fight? I, I actually, wait, you are. I- I see, no. Yeah, you hate that. You fucking gross-ass thing. He hates it. He does not like the fucking things getting shot, chat. This monsters are coming. Ugh, do not want to get hit by that. He's got like a fucking pustule I need to hit on the side there. Good news is, Chad, I can, as long as I don't get hit, I can fast travel whenever I want, provided I get enough mana. He really doesn't stand a fucking chance! At least you have a musket? Yeah, I don't want to use it though, because it sucks. What the fuck is that? <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! It's still alive! Very uncool. I took the healing egg. Chat, I don't see many things to like hit him with now. I gotta get rid of this fucking spider first, though. But I see the spots. Ah! <laughs> ah! Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh, there's a red boy around now, too. I just saw glimpses of him. Okay, I might need the rifle for this properly here. It's like behind his fucking head. I wait for him to like roar to hit him. Ow. <sighs> Very uncool. Well, I guess we'll just hang out for a minute. Dude, I can't fucking aim at that thing while you're like this. It's hard to see like this. Do something. Got it. <laughs> That is a hard, that is a narrow angle. 
Do something. Fuck. Missed it. Missed my chance. Do something. I hear a monster like over here. I gotta reload. Read more Jesus nukes. I need to wait another second. I shouldn't have done it right there. The window is there. I want to do like the throw something at me move, where like throws like an egg at me. Uh, Cause like you can barely see it, but the problem is that like it just sticks out. I've got to deal with the spider. It's also the best source I have for healing. Wherever, where did he go? Oh, he died. Ugh. Give me that. Wow, that's, he's sort of gonna struggle to do much more to me currently. Okay, wait. Gotcha, you son of a bitch! That's just stank? He just threw at me with stank. <laughs> yeah, that was, uh, that was, I don't, not gonna lie, pretty stupid that. Pretty stupid that there was no audio indicator that there was a stank behind me that would instantly kill my guy uh, in that one. Probably should have had some sort of scream. Something like that. I might wait on placing these until uh, later in the fight. Do this whole part with these first. He's just watching. He's just letting me bully him. Fuck. I wanted to get those ones up there real quick. Well, let's take him out. I need to get like closer to him. If I get closer to him, it's easier for me to see the spots, see? I can just fucking clown on him. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I might have deserved that. He just he just picked me up and ate me that time. Alright. I mean like I don't know if that was exactly fair. I'm gonna get the top of this game. Fuck that. Everything else is nice and easy to get for this first phase. I do want to kill this spider though. He's free healing. God, it is really hard to fucking reload when this thing's on you. Ugh. Stone is broken, so once he comes after me with that next phase. I'm just running at full speed. Till it despawned. That was all I knew to do. I'm assuming now he will show himself and become struck uh, by Jesus. He's got all of his weak spots back again. This is multiple phases. Oh, Jesus. Don't get too close or he bites you. What the fuck? 
Oh, there's zombies on me. Jesus! Jesus! Hell yeah! Well, this thing has infinite range even though it's a pistol. Okay. Man, that thing's pretty this thing's pretty fucking spooky, dude. Wish I had more healing around. Okay, let's see if I can let's see if I can do this. Oh, perfect. More healing. Lucky me. I told it to switch guns there. It's a good spot for it too, behind the house. Let's reload my shit before I like peek back out. I'm not gonna get a chance to aim until he's done. Really? Okay, these can also fuck off now. Jesus is all wrapped up on that. Not a oh yeah, that's right, motherfucker. Don't like that, do you? Oh, you hate this! All right, here it comes. No, he's just doing the spit move. I think he might be queuing it though. No, nope, there's still one more. Let's start getting some distance. Here he comes. All right, everyone, cross your fingers. They don't instantly die. All right. Next round. Jesus has helped us. No, I think the rest of this is on us now, chat. We got a good feeling. We got plenty of bullets. We should be able to thrash this fool. Let me just get rid of this. No, I like this one. This one looks nice. Yeah, he hates that. Yeah, you hate that. Yeah, make the make me heal him. Need more healing. Just making it too easy for me! Come on! Spawn of the devil. Ah! Oh boy. Ah. Ah, ah. Oh. Okay. Back to it. My brain, my fucking brain. I can't even see through all this fucking smoke he's making. What is it? Isn't like an active fucking spot. I think it's the two on his head now, which are the hardest ones. It's gonna be one more phase of fucking running too at the end of all this. Got it. Please, for the love of God, don't kill me now with this shit. Please. It's gone. Oh, that stank is scary as fuck, dude. I think it's pretty much it, though. Unless he's got a third phase that I don't know about. I think I'm about to kill this thing. Okay, I'm ready. Show yourself. Show you. Show yourself. Thank you. Perish. Yeah, that's pretty much it. One more. What? Thank you for holding still. <laughs> Just to make sure, again! Pathetic little worm! Was good. He's the evil is officially now defeated. Uh, 
When I'd killed the child of the devil in its true form, the undead finally stopped roaming the forest and people started to move back to Belleville. After a couple of weeks, rare and valuable plants began to grow in the woods near Belleville, which made the town prosperous again. While this battle has been won, the war between good and evil continues. <laughs> I thought that was the sound of an owl flapping its wings was a horse's hooves. But no, it was it was the horse. Off we go. The goat! The fucking goat thing! Do you see that? The fucking goat! Oh! The outro music- this credit music is incredibly loud. So I'm gonna turn it down. That was fun. That was great. As good as it was last time, and this time I was actually able to beat it. Good game. For, like, what it is? I'm looking forward to what the devs make next. I think it's another game of this style. I think they've left the, like, old-timey... Uh, shit behind, which I'm a little bummed about, but I'll still probably check it out, because these devs clearly understand... Uh, you know, an interesting gameplay loop for this kind of game, is perks and stuff like that. Try out perma mode. Ch I died- I would have died in perma mode to a fucking, like, crawling guy, remember? You know how embarrassing it would have been if I had then also died to a fucking, like, little goat boy just slapping me over and over again while I said stop it on, like, the deck of my house? No, I don't think so. Never opened the safe. Also never opened that creepy blue door, but unfortunately I didn't know how or I missed the spot for it. Tip. One meter equals 3.3 feet. Oh. Good game, good game. It's a good, it's a good game. I'm done. I'm gonna switch over to the longing and we are gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna wrap up this stream. A four hour one, but tomorrow, as usually is the case with these, is probably gonna be a longer stream. That's usually how my, how this shit goes. You guys know it by now. Come on. So yeah, we will be back tomorrow. If you're heading out, we're gonna wrap up with the longing, see if maybe the pool's filled. At last. Thanks for watching if you came by for this. Chat. The pool is getting fucking extremely full, I would say. To the point where I could almost say that we might even be able to climb the fucking thing. What are you playing tomorrow? I'm not sure yet. Actually, not sure yet. But we'll see. What place shall I visit today? Let's try. Let's try it. Yeah? Oh my god. It's, I'm almost there. A few more days. I can just reach the other side with my fingertips. Chat. Another couple days. <laughs> In another couple days. We'll be up. Get excited. In a couple of days, we'll be up out of this hole. It's been a literal month of real world time. I've been waiting here for this to fill. And eventually, we'll be up. So fucking close. What is the longing? It is a game where you watch pools fill with water one drip at a time. Uh, I don't honestly understand what you couldn't, what you, what you're not able to grasp from this right now. What an exciting fucking game. This game makes me happy. This game makes me very happy. I love it. I like it. I'm sure it's just going to be another disappointment. Quiet, you. Quiet, you. I don't want to see any more of that. Bullshit. Is this the first part? Yeah, we just started playing the game. The whole game is actually watching this pool fill. Well, chat, it might just be a disappointment. That would be so fucking... That'd be fucked up. But I also wouldn't put it past the game for a second. 
We have 181 days, 15 hours, 43 minutes, and 43 seconds left on our timer before we are allowed to release the king. And what a time it has been so far. Melbert, thanks for the 18 months. Disguised Abnormality, thanks for the tier 2 subscription for 18 months as well. Chat has been so wide lately. I love it. True, true, true. I really, I gotta, get rid, I gotta get rid of the small one, dude. The small one sort of sucks. That can honestly probably fuck off. Small one could probably get out of here. It's just, ugh. Eey. No. <laughs> No. Fish in a tin can. Thank you for the 18 months. I bring you my monthly offering, Red Man. Thank you, thank you. Syncopated 15. Thanks for the 16 months. Crocesuliak. Thank you for the five months. Thank you. Dunder Bunderson. Thank you for the 10 months. Hey, dude. Since you've already had chemistry can i borrow your textbook we're reviewing it for the test later i'll let you borrow of mice and men for me later if you need it no you can't have any my you can't borrow it from me nope sorry dude that's mine even smaller please we need wide people sad to be complete what the fuck even is that do i even care That's not going on. That sorry, dude. That that one's not going in there. Better luck next time. Radiant Worm, thanks for the twenty-six months. Wolf zero oh one, thank you for the nine months. Zerigor, thank you for the eighteen months. Sock Puppet Ninja, thank you for the ten months. Andrews seven forty-five, thank you for the prime. Bleepy bloop, thank you for the nine months. Very kind of you, Sy Alexander, thanks for the nine months as well. Uh, War Guy 777, thanks for the seven months. Clear Puddle, 16 months prime, thank you very much. 16 all months. Snill the Undying, thanks for the three months prime. Alukaze, thanks for the two months. Lost Convict, thanks for the 17 months prime. Huggin Rin, thank you for the eight months prime. Nick Tator the Great, thank you for the 500 bits. Take my bits, you beautiful bastard. Also, thanks for putting up a donation link. I've made my contribution to a better society. Thank you. Oh, yeah. In case people weren't aware. I mean, surely you've seen it rotating through in the chat. Uh, the fundraiser. It will continue to be ran for the coming months. Well, at least month. So go donate instead of giving me your money. Seriously. Uh, little green frog, thank you for the three months. How would you feel if the pool started draining? Ask someone in the chat. Uh, shut the hell up. How about that? Knight Garant, thank you for the 11 months. Hey, Tomato, great content. Uh, question, though. Have you ever made any videos with your friend Toph? Uh, I've always wondered. No, he said he was going to make a video with me, and then he never did. And that was on the first fucking day of the, me making the channel. And by that point, it was already too inconvenient for me to change it. So, yeah, that's been... He deceived me. He let me down. As the saddest part is, dude... Uh, he would have been awesome on YouTube. I genuinely believe he would have fucking totally nailed. He would have he would have been awesome on YouTube if he had wanted to. But I just didn't he just didn't have it. He didn't have it, I guess. Didn't have what it took. Alas. Imagine missing your chance to be part of the tomato gaming brand. Dude, honestly though, sort of lucked out. Shared brands don't usually work out very well in the long in the long term. So uh probably was for the best in the grand scheme of things, even though that guy's still my buddy. Uh, probably for the best that this is a solo project. Probably probably in my in my best interests in the grand scheme. Uh, uh Aklex, thanks for the 15 months prime. Hey, Tomando, do you like pickled foods? I like pickles, but I haven't tried any other pickled foods. 
nor have I seeked them out. That's not that I dislike them, it's just I haven't seeked them out. Bolt Murder, thank you for the 100 bits. Hey, Tomato. Just wanted to say thanks for all your great content. I usually have to watch you on YouTube due to a bad connection, but just wanted to thank you for all your content. I got into Darkest Dungeon after watching you play it. Can't wait to watch you do more World of Horror either. That's going to be coming up. That might even be in the next, like, day or two. Because I've got... I think I want to... I'm not sure if I want to wait for one more update, but there's a bunch of mods out for World of Horror now. That I'm thinking make it... They definitely make it worth streaming. But um, I might give it one more, like, dev update to go with it. Daddy Orokana, thank you for the Prime. Bad Horus, thanks for the 11 months. Bad Fit 66, thanks for the 13 months. Let's fucking go! Let's go! <laughs> Sir Howley, thanks for the 13 months Prime. I had a name change. I don't know if no, but it was Como Drago. Anyways, have a good day. Nice, 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 nice. Thanks for the 13 months, man. Nice. Let's fucking go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Two keys. Thanks for the seven months. Happy birthday, Tomato Gaming. Let's go. All right. Uh, Mystery Ryan 06. Thanks for the subscription. Ya boy. 15. Thanks for the 19 months. We please. Thanks for the 12 months. The deranged optician. Thanks for the 13 months. Finding a name is. Thank you for the five months. Prime. Hey, tomato. I have thoroughly enjoyed your content for quite some time now. Thank you. Hope you're doing well. Don't look behind you. I've been, I always look behind me there. I don't usually look at you guys. So like there was never anything behind me. All right. Unless you mean when I looked around, when I turned around, it was the chat I saw. Is that scary? That's sort of scary, I guess. Uh, Spenhem, thank you for the 12 months, Pride. Hey, Tamto, I recently bought some shoes from a drug dealer. I don't know what he laced them with, but I was tripping all day. Smile. All right, chat, grab that guy. Get him out of here. Throw him out. Yeah, throw him out. Uh, Zexal, thank you for the four months. Let me talk to you about IEDs. <laughs> now, let's, I do need to play that game again. I didn't intend on taking as long of a break from it as I have. Dodger Dude, thanks for the four months. Uh, Prime. Hey, Tanto. I've nearly finished climbing out of the pit. It's taken me a while, but I've forgiven you for accidentally pushing me in. Yeah, huh? it was an accident. Eddie Van W, thanks for the two months. Eat another muffin, thanks for the eight months. Dugan Storm, two months prime. Thank you. Darkness 21, thanks for the two months prime. The Tool Killer, thank you for the prime as well. Gaffin's Cabin, thanks for the eight months. Kitten Wrangler, thanks for the prime. Bowser, six months prime. Deep Fried Gundam, 16 months. Smithy, thanks for the 18 months. Seth the Cleric, thank you for the prime as well. PR Disaster, thanks for the three months. Hello, Tomat. I've noticed something disturbing in the pit. Some of the older dwellers seem to be mutating. I'm sure it's fine, smile. Nah, yeah, it's fine. We're good, we're good. Let's go. <laughs> Mystery Ryan, thanks for the five gifted subscriptions to the channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Very kind of you. David Rock 23, thank you for the prime. Nosada, thanks for the three months. Frost XD, thanks for the two months prime. Palmer, thank you for the 13 months. Crawls out from underneath the pile of unsold copies of Final Fantasy Lightning Returns. Hi, smile. That's a fucking, that was a, that was a fucking, like, that was a dark reach she did there to, like, fucking bring up Final Fantasy 13 3 Lightning Returns into this mix. Jesus Christ. Ouch. Says Square Enix. Ouchie mama. Dude, I like a lot of the Final Fantasy games, but whenever you have to add another number to the end of an already number, you've gone too far. You've gone too far. There's too much depth to this. Honestly, I think that fine. I think that Square Enix, as a collective company, should be fucking thrown in prison for its naming conventions for most of its games. It's um almost no. It is actually illegal some of the shit that they pull across the board on all of their games it's unbelievable look no further than kingdom hearts for your evidence your honor 
And like, you could tell that Kingdom Hearts learned that shit from Square Enix and fucking Final Fantasy. Ugh. Blech. Pud Puddings were, thanks for the thousand bits. Thanks for all the great content, Tamto. In these trying times. Thanks. That made me want to die. Ratman Dan, thanks for the 14 months. Dr. Keckles, thanks for the 12 months. Billy, my son, 1234567, thank you for the 8 months. Uh, Crazier Captain Dice, thanks for the 2 months. Token Over, thanks for the 12 months. Prime Hoping, thank you for the Prime as well. Neo Blumbo, thank you for the 4 months. Prime Luke, 55755, thanks for the 5 months. Prime Hypocrite, thank you for the subscription. And Drulio5, thanks for the 13 months prime. Hey, Tomato, I've really been enjoying the streams lately. You've been doing a great job. Keep it up, blocked, and reported. Uh, uh, oh. Alright. MB Pierre, thank you for the 15 months. Satanana, thank you for gifting a sub. Witchcraft, thanks for the 13 months. This reminds me of a bad old time traveling FPS. You mean Darkest of Days. I didn't even need to read the rest of it to know what you're talking about. Um. That, that game was nowhere near as crusty as Darkest of Days was. Don't ever fucking evoke that name again in my presence. That game was a video was a gaming sin. That was a bad that was a bad scene. It's me, Michelle. Thank you for the ten months. What a surprise it What a surprise it was to see you at the pit luau last month after you said you were going to have it cancelled. Glad to have such a great glad you had such a great time. See you down here again soon. Chat, that person is lying. I know that because they're dead. They've been dead for two weeks now. They uh they they're gone. You have to let them go. They're gone. They've been gone. Poof. They blew up a long time ago. Oh, okay, yeah. Then who sent the message? A ghost. The specter of the person who blew up. Of course, duh. But we don't have to listen to them. Ghosts are notorious liars. X Gibbons X, thanks for the five months. Prime Neff 2019, thank you for the five months as well. Hey, Tomato, you always find really interesting games to play. I'm hyped for the Space Station 13 content. Have you played much of the game before? Not exactly, but uh, frankly, between you and me, I'm probably going to be taking little peeks at servers and stuff to just passively learn the game on my own prior to the servers even being open for you guys to learn, just so I'm not embarrassing myself. Just so I'm not embarrassing myself, that'll probably... I'll probably take care of that shit off stream over the course of the next week or two. Uh... The Kia Dane, thank you for the subscription. Saren White, thanks for the 18 months and the 245 bits. Wow, so fun that Twitch is making me watch ads when I'm subbed to you, smile. Nice, man. Bullet Collector, 18 months. Thank you. Requiem League, thanks for the six months prime. Chupacabra, thank you for the subscription as well. Kneecap, 68, thanks for the eight months prime. Crazier Captain Dice, thanks for the 150 bits. Thank you for the stream tab, Joe. I thank you for watching, man. And Giant Dragon Dongs. Thank you for the 10 months. Love your no tolerance for jackasses in chat. It's super refreshing. Keep up the wicked streams. Thanks. Thank you. It's just like, I don't know. I don't like I don't like I don't like letting people get away with being idiots in my chat because then everyone looks at that idiot and says, I'm gonna be like that. I don't know. That's why I, that's why that's why I get toxic every once in a while, chat, because if I don't get toxic at the one person causing a problem, like a fucking cancerous tumor they will spread to the rest of the community. You know? That's why I do what I do. I think. Alright. So I'm out of here, chat. I will see you guys tomorrow at three to four PM EST. You know how this goes. I am going to raid uh, Robaz today because he's still streaming and hopefully he doesn't end the second I raid him like some fucking asshole. All right. I'm going to raid Robaz. He's playing Polybridge. See you guys tomorrow. 3 to 4 p.m. EST. It's been a pleasure. Goodbye. 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 Goodbye.